be shooting, right? No, don't bite, don't bite. Don't bite in. Don't bite in. Don't bite in, please. What is this? Don't bite. Dust and cloud. Okay, so okay, so I just woke up and I'm kind of in a cooking and creative sort of mood. And and there's a, a new sauce idea I have for a while. I have only work with the fish. And I, but I haven't had a chance to test it out. I even made some puree for it. I just haven't had a chance to test it out. And I was finally going to do it today. I bought a fish a few days ago and uh, I filleted it. And I was going to actually make a sauce today. I was just going to cook the fish and, and make the sauce and eat for lunch. But Emma just reminded me that we still have some leftover roasted chicken from yesterday that's sitting in the fridge. So she ordered me basically. Dish that I normally go every time we have a level of meat. Uh, I tested, I, yeah, see, uh, see for cloud. I cooked that dish for the first time using the barbecue chicken level we had that time, and she loved it. So she asked me to cook that again, 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 and again. Today. So, so I guess uh, my fish and the new sauce uh, has to wait, and I be cooking the. <laughs> I'll be cooking the I'll be cook I'll be cooking the I'll be cooking the what am I cooking? So I'll be doing that. But it's a good thing because uh, by doing that and shooting a video of it, you will get a new awesome recipe so you can make it at home. Every time you have a leftover chicken, it's a good thing for me too because I'm gonna win a few cooking points with the missus for cooking whatever what she wants. So let's do that. Okay, bye. Bye. Okay, after a quick bread walk, we now have ingredients I will be using. They are pretty simple ingredients. We have cow parsley leaves, tomatoes, garlic, lime leaves, Mexican peppers, and white onions. Now slice up those leftover chicken. It doesn't have to be chicken, obviously. You can use any other leftover meat. Pan on the stove. Heat up some cooking wine. Garlic in. Start a bit. Place the chicken. We will just sear them quickly. Season with pepper. Start them gently for a bit. And try to get nice color on both sides. That's it, chicken done. Let's plate them. Only the big pieces. Don't worry about small broken ones. We will use them when we made the sauce. Now let's make the sauce. Cooking wine again. Garlic and onions first. A bit of curry powder. Give them a stir. Fresh lime leaves goes in. Really smells delicious, guys. Stir a bit. Tomatoes and peppers goes in. Mix well. Once they are soft, you can add the chicken stock or water. If you don't have the stock, it's still gonna be awesome. 
This is a great dish really to cook when you're feeling lazy. It's easy, quick, simple, plus balanced and delicious. So try at home, okay? I also put in small chicken pieces uh, I left out earlier. Okay, now let's put in some milk. Salt to taste. And just sort of bring them together. Now pour the sauce onto the chickens, the lime leaves, peppers, tomato, they are giving nice colors to the plate and put garlic parsley on top. Leave that for now and let's make the rice. Put the new or leftover rice in the pan. Mix with the sauce and chicken pieces. Egg white in. Mix them together. You need to season with salt and pepper. Keep stirring for a bit until they are quite sticky. Okay, I think we got it. So just plate the rice beside chicken. Quickly fry the egg yolk and place it on the rice. Garnish done. Rice and egg salad with leftover chicken and super yummy sauce serve. Okay, that's it for today guys. Subscribing as always is free, so do that if you haven't. We'll be back with more awesome recipe later. So until then, adios.